The MPs stealthily drove to Mitiana to check on their fellow legislator Francis Zake, who returned to the country on 11th October after receiving specialized medical treatment from India. They deliberately chose not to draw the public's attention to their visit and managed to sneak into Zake's home in Buswabulongo, Mitiana, without much fanfare. However, shortly afterwards, residents got wind of the legislator's visit and they quickly gathered in Zaki's compound. <laughs> The crowd soon grew and began chanting and singing, especially when MP Robert Chagulani was spotted. <laughs> Shortly afterwards, soldiers began to surround Zake's home. <laughs> The visiting MP spoke to the crowd that had gathered. Though he's weak, but uh, there is promise that he should be able to recover. And we pray that by the time we finish the recess, he should be able to join us and then we continue the struggle. You remember the president was saying Zakia has escaped from prison. In his mind, he didn't even want Zakia to surface in a hospital. So they could not even allow people to freely visit him in a hospital. We are still praying for a very quick recovery so that he can be able to go back to Parliament. After their visit, the MPs made a procession through Mitiana town before driving back to Kampala.